Hello. Oh. Thanks for getting me through Bitfest again. I was gonna do this on stream, but then I realized that would be really messy, so I'm making a video of it. I've watched a lot of Brad Mondo. I, I'm i feeling really confident about this. I got bleaching powder, 30 volume developer. I have this toner. I've never heard of this brand, but it was cheap, so I bought it. This is the queen I'm hoping to look like. Why is she so cool? I did get my hair professionally cut for the first time in like three years. And now I'm professionally fuck it up. I also have um, an undercut which I assume we're just gonna do last because it's right next to my head. It starts pretty high on her head. Like all of this on her, on her is blonde. I'm pretty ho-hum about my hair. I've bleached my hair before and not toned it and just had orange hair for a couple months. But that's because you didn't know better. I didn't know better and I also just didn't care. I did it and I was like, well, that was a fun experience. Moving on now. <laughs> measure out this baby. It smells bad, but it looks very appetizing. We're going very slow, so we're gonna put some foil in. Moment of truth. Ooh. It's not very light. It's not as light as I thought it was. No, it's, it's not that light. <laughs> it looks lighter at the top. We gotta wait, we gotta wait longer to do those roots. Wait, I'm gonna be honest, why does the top look lighter? That's really light. But the ends, I don't know if they're not saturated enough or what, but they're still like light, mousy brown. Alex thinks that the foil is like pulling the bleach off of area, which is why we might be getting patchiness, which is like really fun and cute. And Awesome. So, this is it with more bleach. You know what this is? This is payback for all of the years since COVID started that I've been cutting your hair. Oh, payback time. It wasn't supposed to be cute. I'm ready for the itchiness to start. Yeah. I just don't understand how this is lightened so much, but the ends are so dark still. This isn't even close to my scalp. I think somehow I must have fucked up. <laughs> Are you massaging it into my undercut? Should I not be doing that? <laughs> it just feels weird. Daisy's been complaining through the whole thing. She's finally caked it. Just here, yeah. It it needs another bleach. I mean it's still wet, but like we'll see in the morning. It needs another bleach. <gasps> Back to my dog. Wow, we actually look really similar though. It's a week later and as you can see I still have not given it a second bleach because I wanted it to wait for my hair to get like oily again before I did it so it didn't sting as much as it did last time hopefully I'm being a bit of a baby but but yeah as you can see it definitely needs a second bleach hopefully my hair doesn't fall out <laughs> like because my whole head isn't this color I actually haven't minded it too much like obviously it needs to be toned but we're not doing the roots we're just doing the ends and then either today or tomorrow we will tone are we gonna attempt foiling it like section by section so that it doesn't like pull the bleach off like it did last time it's pretty coated Ow. You can see it's still pretty orange. Oh, come on. It's light at the top, but we've got a pretty clear line there that goes into orange. I'm not super concerned about it as I've had orange hair all week and it's been fine. We're going to tone it regardless. I got a level nine toner, which I don't think this is a level nine. I think this is maybe even a nine or 10. Uh, up the top there, it's very pale yellow, but then like, I mean, it looks worse on camera, but it is, it is still orange. Just gonna give it a go. It's pretty patchy, but I think it's a good job for a first attempt. I'm gonna miss this cute look. After it dried yesterday, Alex just goes, wow, this color makes your skin look so red. <laughs> Thanks, I didn't say so red. Fine, for a fleshy pink. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. I also gave us some protector oil to add. So. What's that do? I don't know. 
protect me. No, let me do it. I want to do it. <laughs> okay, you can do it. I don't really buy like hair masks and stuff, but I do put castor oil in my hair every now and then. I used to put it on before we go to football and then I'd play with it in <laughs> for the game. It looks nasty, like super greasy, but it stopped uh, my heavy ass hair from falling out of a ponytail, which was ideal. This smells kind of vanilla-y. <laughs> Chemical vanilla. This better look perfect because I have to go out into public today. Yeah, I can. Actually, I don't know where I'm going. I'm supposed to go out tonight, but still haven't got COVID, so, you know. I'll keep the streak running of never leaving the house ever. Are you sure that's not supposed to go in your hair? Have you read the instructions? Yes, I read the instructions. Okay, that's smart. It looks so good with the dye on it. Yeah. Like it looks like it's doing work, but. <laughs> Well, this mm. is how it lasts. Mm. It's supposed to last like six weeks. Maybe I should shave the sides of my head. Anyway, I'm gonna leave this in, I think, for a total of a half hour. And um, you guys can judge how well I did. Hello. Put you there. Well, it's patchy. I think I got really lucky that we didn't do my whole head. It's, you know, it's, it's kind of orange under there. To be honest, I don't mind the color. It's actually pretty nice up here and I like the look of it. I think I get away with the bad tone job because I haven't done my whole head. I'm glad that we decided not to do my whole head. I mean, this is the look that I wanted to go for. I was keen to go for the whole head in a couple months or something once I got sick of this. I like this a lot more than I thought I was going to. Like, I kind of just feel like myself, like it's a little weird, I'm a pretty strange person. I don't know, I might do the whole head at some point, but at this stage I really like it. I might bleach it again in a month or two, uh, just when I've got some regrowth and stuff just to touch it up and I don't know how to get these bits lighter. We bleached it again and it barely lightened, so... I don't really know what's happening with that. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching. I maybe will do this again on my whole head at some point. We'll see. But at this stage, I'm happy with it. So yeah, get you a boyfriend who bleaches your hair. <laughs>